All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. My name is Corey, and today we're going to be talking about a new weapon added to Adventure Quest Worlds along with the AQ3D. It's hard not to put a W after AQ beta, which has gone live on Steam today. Let's get into the video. All right. So the first thing is that the AQ3D beta is alive. So if you haven't been able to get into AQ3D to play the game, I'll show you how to do it. So this is Steam. Um, you have to install the client on your computer. Just uh, type in Steam on your browser and you can find it, install it. It's the most used PC platform. It's what everyone sells their games on. So to find AQ3D, you're gonna wanna go to store, uh, go to games, go to, go to games. Games. Okay, why is the why is the UI moving around? Go to free to play, and then go to popular new releases. AQ3D will be right there, or you can just go to your search bar and type in AQ3D, and you will find that right there, free to play. Um, so you see the trailer and a bunch of stuff. You can just hit the play now button. I think you will need a Steam account to play it. And once you hit play now, it'll download the game. It's not even a gigabyte, so it's a really small file. Uh, then you go to your library. You will find it in your library under Adventure Quest Games. Click play, and that will launch the game. And of course, you need an AQ3D account. Uh, you can figure out how to do that. It'll explain it once you launch the game. So that's how you get the game on Steam. Other than that, um... That's just for people that are new to Steam. I know a lot of people already use Steam a lot. So, to get the new weapons that were added to Adventure Quest Worlds today, uh, to celebrate, I guess, the launch of AQ3D, just go to slash join, uh, and then go where I went. The map is taking way too long to load. Damn, the server's slow today. So, go to slash join AQW3D. <laughs> this looks so weird. And then go into the Yolgar here. And then upstairs in the Yolgar, you'll find these weapons. So these three weapons, they drop as items in AQW. Uh, according to the design notes, it's a very low drop chance. Uh, there's a small chance you will get the Nightlock weapons uh, as a reward drop. Uh, and it tells you what it's for. Uh, this map was put out for April Fools this year, and it's being reused right now for... Uh, the launch of AQ3D. So if you want to get these items, you can farm for them. We'll probably farm for them on a stream maybe tomorrow. Uh, I'm not going to farm for them today. I'll be on AQ3D on stream tonight. If I can stream, guys, leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it. Also, there's a bunch of new news. Uh, I'll go over it really quick. They confirmed the level cap is going to increase after phase one of server rewrite, which is good. It'll re increase to 80 and then 85 in March. Um, so a level cap increase will be good. Of course, I'll go in depth more with this in the news video. And I think there's one other thing I want to talk about about AQW, but I'll leave that for the news video on Thursday, which is tomorrow. So I'll see you guys all in the video tomorrow. I may be streaming AQ3D tonight. If you want to keep up with that, follow me on Twitter, and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Follow all my social media links in the description. Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, all that stuff. Uh, I stream on Twitch sometimes. I post all the videos to Facebook and Twitter is where I talk about dumb shit and also post videos and tell you when I'm streaming there. So if you want to follow me there, go ahead and do so. I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace. Oh yeah, click the top right corner for the last video I uploaded. Bye.